Hello YouTube, this is PCB Slimhax and today I'm going to show you how you could import uh, transfer photos from your iPhone, iPad, or iPad directly into your uh, MacBook. Uh, recently I just got a MacBook Pro and so that that opens up a, a lot of opportunities for me for I could uh, make Mac tutorials as well and not just PC. So uh, at first, the first videos that I'm going to be uploading, they're probably going to be fairly simple t simple. Um, tasks that people will, will probably know by now but for me as a first Mac user experience I had trouble finding it because switching from PC to uh, Mac the operating system is very differently I mean it's almost the same but there's some some differences here and there but overall uh, you'll get the general idea and then from after a week or s the tem depending how long it takes for you to get used to something but yeah so uh, today is just a very simple video on how to transfer or import photos from your iPhone into your MacBook Pro. So uh, the first things first, all you have to do is just um, connect your iPhone directly into the phone. I mean, directly into the into the laptop. So as you can see, I have the cable already connected to here. And now let's just go directly into the screen. Now that you have your iPhone, iPod, or iPad connected to your MacBook, you want to go all the way to the top right. There's going to be a magnifying glass, and you want to click on it, and it's going to bring you to the, to the spotlight search. So uh, from there, this is where you want to type image capture. It should appear right away. It's going to be uh, in the applications. So you just want to double click on that. And then it's going to bring you to, um, to whatever content you have on your iPhone, iPad, or iPod. Uh, it's just going to show the, the pictures you say, taking screenshot, or whatever. Uh, and this is where technically you get to import them from. So uh, let's say I just want to import this picture of a lightning strike. And you could select multiple pictures by uh, by holding command and clicking on each one that you want or desire to uh, transfer to your MacBook. But I just want um, the lightning strike one. So uh, before hitting import or import all if you want to take everything and just uh, save it into your MacBook. Uh, Right here where it says import to, this is where the, the destination of your, of whatever you're going to import is going to be at that destination. So right now I just have it set up as desktop, that way I'll see it right away. So uh, you can change it wherever you want, whether if it's uh, video clips, you could just put it to movies, pictures, pictures, documents, however you want. It's your choice. But right now I'm just going to save the little lightning picture uh, to my desktop. So I'm just going to hold, hold command, click on the picture, and I'm just going to hit import. So as you can see, it already imported. So I'm just gonna exit this out, and it's right here. So uh, it's it's a thank you for guys for watching. I know it was a very simple video, but uh, this is for first timers on using a Mac like me. Honestly, I couldn't even find on how to uh, import my iPhone pictures into my MacBook since I'm new to this stuff. But it gives me a lot of opportunities to make more videos for you guys, not just PC, but now Mac related. So which is good, a good thing. For all of us, it benefits benefits us all. But yeah, guys, thank you guys for watching. Please give it a like, comment on what you think, and please subscribe, guys. It really helps me a lot. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.